Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Juan Motivates. Yo, man, I just want to thank you guys, as always, for coming to my channel, uh, supporting, watching, leaving me comments, uh, you know, through engaging, man, through all this. I get to learn from you guys and what you guys would like to know. And I kind of, like, get to know you guys on a personal level, man, because it feels like the same people ask me questions. You kind of get to know them. You kind of get to build a relationship. And that's super cool to me, man. I mean, I never thought that me making radiology videos, you'll build some kind of like, as you can say, someone like a friendship, you know what I mean? Cause uh, you know, you know, you I, I make the videos, you ask for help and I help you. Uh, and sometimes guys, like I do it, I do it on a personal level, man. Like I always tell you guys, like follow me on Instagram at jreacts863. You'll see my little ugly mug on there, man. You can DM me, just let me know it's you. DM me your questions and I will, hey, I'm, gonna be, I'm gonna sincerely get back to you and let you know, um, uh, what you need to know and I'm gonna always keep it truthful, you know um, So we're almost there man. We're almost monetized on this channel man, which is super cool super dope to even think That my radiology slash, you know barber channel, whatever will ever be monetized I honestly didn't think about that. You know, I was always like, you know what? Let me just make content that people are asking for have fun with it be truthful and um, And it's cool man to almost get to that point you know, we're a little bit over 100 hours before you can get monetized, if YouTube monetizes it. I don't know. But, you know, end of the day, man, I, I really enjoy helping you guys. And I really enjoy, you know, being on here on this awesome platform to be able to give you um, information and knowledge that you guys ask for or seek. Um, so anyway, man, today I want to talk to the radiology students, right? I want you to know, guys, that when y'all come to clinicals, you have to understand, man, that you guys are special. You guys are special for various reasons. You know what I'm saying? You guys are special because you actually took the initiative to go to to go to school, to get your prereqs done, um, and to make your goal happen. I'm not gonna say your dream because dreams change. You know what I mean? Um, but goals, goals are goals change too. But Dreams are feels like, I feel when you say dreams, like, oh, I want to like a Lamborghini, you know, things like that. Like those are dreams, right? But goals, like radiology goals, that's a goal, you know what I'm saying? And then in a few years, you might have a different goal of becoming a nurse. You know, you just never know. So, you know, you're special, man, for following your goals. Um, two, you're special, man, because you got accepted into the program. You know how many students actually try to get into the radiology program and don't make it because of various reasons, their grades, whatever the case may be, and then make it, you're special because of that. You know, so um, I say that to say this, right? When you come to clinicals, you have to come with that confidence. I don't care if it's your first year, I don't care. Build that confidence before you come to clinicals and be like, you know what? I'm gonna see one and I'm gonna do one. Basically means that if a tech shows you how to do a chest x-ray, you have to show initiative and be like, you know what? I'm gonna do the next one. Because you are special, man. You are special because you're in the program. If you weren't special enough, if the, if the if the college or the teachers or whoever accepted you into the program, they didn't think that you had it, you had what it takes to be there, they wanna make you, they wanna let you into the program. So you have what it takes to do that x-ray. So you see one and you do one, even if you can't comp on it, it's okay. Be like, look, you showed me one, let me let me do the next one. If I mess up, it's okay. At least you tried. And and by doing that and by going in there and showing that initiative, man, that technologist is gonna wanna even help you more and wanna be around you more because you wanna learn. You wanna be there. You know what I'm saying? So basically, man, have the confidence to understand that you're special and that you belong there because you were chosen. All right? So all the radiology students, man, Trust me, man, I know how hard it is to be there. I know how um, scary it is to go to clinical sites and to be in a real hospital with real patients, um, administration, like, uh, administrating uh, ra uh, radiation, and you don't want to over-penetrate or over this or over that. But trust me, man, when you're there with the technologist, he's not going to make you make a mistake to the point that you're going to hurt a patient. All right. And if you're not, and, and if you're a student and you're at a hospital or whatever clinical site you are and that technology is being super hard on you, just ignore it, man. Ignore it and just don't. Every every clinical site is insane. You know, yeah, you're going to get some people like that. I had people like that. You know, when I was a student, I would go like, hey, you know, how you doing, sir? You know, can I do this x-ray? And in one minute, he'd be like, yeah. And the next minute, he'd be like, 
fuck it. No, excuse my language. You'd be like, get out of my face. You know what I'm saying? It's like, what changed from one minute to the next, you know? You're going to have texts like that, you know? And, and that's okay. You know what I'm saying? You just stay focused. Have the vision of where you want to be, man, and you're going to get there. So... I know, I know I said a lot, but what I'm just trying to say, guys, is that you radiology students that are in the program, you are special. You got what it takes to become an awesome technologist, and you were chosen for a reason. So go in there with confidence, do what you got to do, and don't be scared to try it.